What I think about people who have abandoned their homes, um, left their homes and moved to a tiny house lifestyle or permaculture homesteading lifestyle. I've just stepped into this journey. It was a fearful step. Almost feels like our wings are starting to grow because before it was the, I need to pay the mortgage. I need to pay the mortgage. Every month it was the mortgage, the mortgage, the mortgage. And this continued for 13 years, just throwing it into this big hole that never gets filled. So now for the first time that um, I'm not burdened by the bond, if I had an opportunity to return to the house and continue the old path of staying in Joburg and smelling that stinky river, I'd, I'd never go back. We've got our skills, we've learned some skills, we've got our hands, we've got health. We can always recreate a new reality. Zoya and myself can survive and thrive in any situations that life throws at us. So if you are being scared to leave the Kabbalah system and mortgage repayments, that means that you're scared to create something with your hands. But if you learned the skills, and you are not scared to create something with your hands, then it's just one step out. And this step, I just did it, and it's an empowering feeling. That's the start. If we don't have that basis, what are we talking about? We are forever enslaved by ourselves. Nobody's enslaved us. We have enslaved ourselves by not learning those skills. So we offer how to build a house and how to catch, recycle your own water. With permaculture principles, I've traveled the world and I've learned from great masters and I really truly want to share this with you. Develop your skills, learn your skills, because as you learn your skills, you're going to be able to literally build your new reality out there in the most beautiful and pristine nature and protect that nature. Because ultimately, we know each one of us is striving towards living a holistic life in unison with our Mother Earth. So learn your skills so you, can, you don't have the fear to be homeless or um, not have enough water because you'll always be able to make a plan just with his hands and some bit of ingenuity. We wish you a good path into the future and beyond.